drinks and families connecting. These embody what we call a real Trini Christmas, but for those living with diabetes, they are forced to walk a thin line, engaging in a balancing act to keep their blood sugar levels under control. President of the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago, Andrew Danu, says the after effects of drinking often take a heavy toll. For most persons with diabetes, having one drink is okay once your blood sugars are controlled. But we know that if you are consuming alcohol in excess, it can do one of two things. It can either raise your blood sugar in, in the short term, because often when you drink alcohol, it's often, um, it, you often have, uh, have a highly sugar, sugary um, chasers together with the alcohol. So that raises your sugar in the, in, in the short term. But what, what also happens after is that there is an effect that happens after you consume the alcohol that may cause your sugar to drop significantly. And what's dangerous about that is that the, the same feeling you may get, or the same sensations you may get when you're, when you're high or when you're tipsy by drinking alcohol may also be the same sensations you get when your blood sugar is low. So for persons living with diabetes, especially persons on insulin, we advise to stay away from the alcohol. And if you do want to consume alcohol, you should have your blood sugars control and one drink is sufficient. Food, alcohol and snacks in the wrong portions could be dangerous. If you aren't particularly sure if foods are right for you, um, we always advise that when you are diagnosed, one of the first things you need to do is contact and speak to a nutritionist or a dietitian. Um, at the Diabetes Association, we have nutritionists and registered dietitians av- available with, who do counseling sessions free of charge. Um, and we always encourage persons to access these services because they are a big step towards managing your diabetes. Because what we understand about nutrition, it's not just about the food that you put in your mouth. Nutrition is multi multifaceted. It, it, it has to do with where you get the food, if you could afford the food, how you cook the food. The president of the Diabetes Association says the development of personalized diets is a step in the right direction for those with this disease. With your TTT News Health Check, I am Crystal Wilson.